The Virunga volcanoes lie in the heart of Central Africa. Their slopes are one of the last refuges of the mountain gorilla. This real-life King Kong saves his strength and ferocity for defending his family. He's a gentle and committed father, dedicated to his females and young. But their peaceful life together will come to an end if we do nothing to help. There are now only a few hundred left. Their forests are shrinking. People living near the gorillas are poor and need more farmland. And their fields are rapidly encroaching on the forest. But this forest is vital. It preserves the climate and rainfall needed to grow cash crops and food for the growing population. Lose the forest, and you risk losing everything. While gorillas pose little threat to us, we pose a deadly threat to them. Sir David Attenborough first visited the gorillas while filming the Life on Earth series in 1978 and helped to set up what would become the International Gorilla Conservation Program, or IGCP, which helps both the gorillas and local people. While only a few of us will ever see a wild gorilla, we all enjoy the fact that they exist. But the cost of protecting them is borne by local people. IGCP works to make sure that they also benefit, so the gorillas become both a source of income and national pride. It's proved a great success, and the population has risen by 12%. People have to understand that if we want this world to include species such as mountain gorillas, and to also allow a species like mountain gorillas to contribute to the welfare of people and to help alleviate their poverty, which is something that this species is uniquely positioned to do, then we all need to help make that possible. And we all need to actively take on some responsibility. Well, as we began the search to find the character of Kong, uh, I went to Rwanda to observe mountain gorillas. And it was an amazing experience. It was, uh, it was thrilling, it was, it was quite humbling. And the more that I observed this family, the more that I realised that I, I wanted to become involved in ensuring their safety in the future. If gorillas were to become extinct, I think we'd very much be in danger of, of losing touch with a, a very deep part of ourselves. I'd like to encourage people to support IGCP because I'd hate to deprive the children of the future the sense of connection that I felt when I witnessed mountain gorillas. Um, I'd hate to live in a world where mountain gorillas were a memory. And I'd like to see that the fate of a character like Kong remains only in the realm of film and fantasy and definitely not in reality. Gorillas are truly amazing animals. Without them there wouldn't be entertainment like King Kong. It's really vital that we take this opportunity to realise how similar they are to us and how endangered they are. There are only 706 mountain gorillas left. That's like the population of a small village in a world of six and a half billion people. I'd like to invite everyone to support the work that IGCP is doing, not just for the sake of the gorillas, but for the people that live alongside them, and so that future generations can live in a world where gorillas are more than a memory. Gorillas are some of the most magnificent, charismatic and intelligent animals on earth. 
they are also our close relatives. I believe we've all got a responsibility to ensure that they survive into the future. Please help us and support the work of IGCP and if you want more information about the project, you'll find it on your seats.